Alright people, welcome back to another video. Alright guys, so today I got some exciting news for you guys. So Lenovo, they actually release the drivers and the new BIOS that they promised, right? So both of them they released today. They saying on the forum that's in it's in beta form right now, but it's still usable. So they released it officially from them. It's it's good overall what I'm seeing online. There's not a lot of bugs. Any if there's any bugs in there that we should report it and help them out to smooth it out in the future. Right? So let me get into it real quick and I'll show you guys how to install it. So first I'm gonna show you guys how to install the, the drivers and then to how to install the right the new BIOS V28. I'm put the link down below. It's two different links for the Legion Go community. So one is for the drivers and one is for new BIOS. Alright, so first the driver, you just gotta come to the link down below. You're just gonna click on the AMD 200D000. Once you download it, wherever you downloaded that, you just gotta click on it, which is this one right here. When you open it, you go in here, then you open it again. Then you gotta click on the gfxinstall.bat, this file, which is right here. Once you click on that, just hit extract. Alright, so when you get to the GFX install dot bat, um, I forgot to record this part, but just make sure you extract it. Once you extract it, then it'll extract the file and you go back in there. When you come back here to this file, you right click and you got to run it as an administrator, right? When you do that, put that down, then you run anyway, hit yes. A command prompt is going to pop up on your screen. Just let it, let it do its thing. Your system might restart. So now how you check it, you just go to device manager. Then when you get here, you click on display, you right click, go to properties, go to drivers, and then it's going to show you the new date, right? Which is November 7th, 2023. So those are the new official new drivers from Lenovo. So that's how you know when you're up and running with the drivers, right? Now, let me show you how to install the new BIOS. So once you download the new BIOS file, just got to go to the file. Make sure your device is plugged in, guys. Make sure it's plugged in and you close all the, the apps and stuff that you have. Make sure everything is closed. You don't got nothing open. Then you just click on the N3C and 28WWEX. Run it away. Hit next. See, so it's telling you make sure you plugged in. You hit next. And you just let it do its thing. After you install the new BIOS V28, let's log in. So now I'm going to show you guys how to change the RAM, show you, make sure you're up and running. So make sure you just power off, power off the device. So let's boot up into the BIOS settings. You hold volume up and press the power button once. Or you can hold them together and then you boot up into it. There you go. So now you go to BIOS setup. Go to more settings, configuration. When you scroll down to UMA frame buffer, so now you could change between three, four, and six. So six gig is, is the best best option for us for the games and stuff like that for it to run as smooth as possible. Also, what they change if you scroll down, maximum memory data clock speed. Right, you could change this between six to four hundred and seven five hundred. Out the box. When you just download the V28 BIOS, it's on uh, 7500, right? Also, remember guys, remember they said this is a beta. So if there's any issue, just go back to the Lenovo Legion Go community website and tell them what's going on. But this is officially from Lenovo. So it should be running as smooth as possible. So yeah, guys, so that's basically it. Thanks for tuning in. Uh, drop a comment down below. Let me know what you think. Leave a feedback. Tell me how it's going. And how the, how was the process doing this install? And remember to always see guys health is wealth, peace and love. I'm out. Thanks for tuning in, guys.